Hey guys, welcome back again. I hope you enjoyed realizing the subtle art of understanding that awareness does not have a form whatsoever. It's such a beautiful, subtle realization and I hope you enjoyed having some of that. And it will become more profoundly clear and evidential to you over time. So today's lesson is called unaffectedness, which is one of the qualities, one of the coordinate qualities of awareness is that it will always be unaffected. And by now this may seem like clear science. And if it does, that's absolutely great. If it's absolutely clear to you that awareness is absolutely unaffected because it's empty, therefore it cannot be affected by presences. It is formless. It doesn't have a form of its own. Therefore nothing can touch it. And it will always be here beyond appearances, beyond forms. It is spacious. You can always enjoy the spacious nature of awareness, the expansive nature and freedom of I, I. Awareness, aware of awareness. And the timelessness, which we'll get into the next lesson. So you will see that all these qualities generate a very, very clear sense of your well-being becoming unaffected because your well-being becomes identified as its true nature, which is already unaffected. Awareness withdraws its in a sense, it's affection or it's identification from the I am this and even from the I am presence energy to the I, awareness, spaciousness, freedom, emptiness, timelessness, unaffectedness. And because awareness does that through your reflection mechanism, through your ability to take those two to five second interruptions of the mind of illusion and of the mind of illusion and start to see through those interruptions, the clarity of sky like spacious free awareness. Because of your commitment and ability to recognize this over and over and over again for these brief periods of time at a time and in meditation settings for more profound, longer focused understandings of awareness, you will start, you will actually start to gain in your sense of well-being, being absolutely freed up, absolutely freed up from fear, from feelings being identified with, from thoughts being identified with. And you will see that all of this is nothing but a spacious fireworks display, not affecting the sky within which it is displayed. The sky is not affected. The space is not affected. Space could not be affected. Consciousness awareness could not be affected because it doesn't have a form of its own. See, if awareness had a form of its own, it could somehow be collided with by another form. But since it does not have whatsoever any form, no form that comes into being can ever harm something that has no form. You cannot hit something or be in conflict with something or wrestle with something that has no form. It's impossible. Awareness is absolutely utterly formless and therefore completely empty and unaffected. So let be, learn to let be your thoughts and emotions and your tensions and give it away, give it up, give it back to the space within which it is always already perfectly rested and freed up. Free yourself up by letting your perceptions run free, run amok, run wild. And see that your beingness, your essence, your formlessness, your changeless awareness remains as the empty, free, timeless, spacious, formless, witnessing, perceiving awareness principle of whatever occurs and is itself completely unaffected by the forms and the appearances and the comings and goings of life. Rest in the unaffectedness of awareness. Make that your priority for the next two days at the very least. Start noticing that when you're having thoughts and emotions, they are nothing but appearances arising in free, spacious, formless awareness. And that the free, spacious, formless awareness, because it is free, spacious and formless, is not at all affected by your trauma, by your emotions, by your depression, by your joys. It is completely unaffected. It's the completely unaffected form of the ground of being. Even to call it a ground of being already sounds too much like the I am presence energy. We're talking very spacious here, very sky-like, very free, very free agency, very free awareness. I, spacious. So let's not call it the ground of being actually. Let's call it the ultimate free agent. Let's call it the ultimate free formlessness that contains all of creation and is never affected, does never even blink, does never even flinch to anything that appears. Wouldn't you like to regain this confirmation? Would you not like 
and endure to feel this way so powerfully that you can walk into any given circumstance and know that it doesn't matter if you become emotional. It doesn't matter if you start doubting creation. It doesn't matter if you start doubting yourself or having doubtful thoughts. You are actually unaffected. You do not have to worry about your worries. You can let them all be free. You can let your emotional being completely be there. And instead of identifying with the thoughts and emotions, identify with the unaffected spaciousness, which remains and abides at all times because it's outside of time. It's so delicious speaking from and as unaffected formless awareness to unaffected and formless awareness. It's very nice to see myself as you, to sense myself in you as you, looking back at itself, creating this infinite mirror, looking at itself. Beautiful clear, crisp, free, nothing, empty, spacious, deliberate, yet absolutely willless in a sense, absolutely free, free will, but willless, meaning without tension, without need to push anything away. Deliberate, yet free, conscious, alive, awake, yet at ease and relaxed and calm, all at the same time. Simply by learning to tune into again and again and again and again and again, effortlessly so, enjoying the process of tuning into, recognizing the clarity of awareness that's already here. The spaciousness, the freedom, the formlessness, the unaffectedness of this moment. Notice that you're already not affected. You can do anything. You can feel anything. You can think anything. And all of that is nothing but fireworks appearing in empty, formless, spacious, clear, awake. Awareness. You, the ultimate free agent, is the ultimate free agent, no matter what happens. So, the homework for this lesson is to emphasize this throughout everyday life. Take those two to five seconds, at least 25 times a day, but as more, as more if you want to, as much as you can. Five, 50 times, 500 times, I was going to say, but that, you can do that too. 500 times, why not? Try it out. 500 times today and tomorrow. You take that moment sincerely to recognize the pristine nature of free formless unaffectedness of this moment. Notice that you're already unaffected even when you're having feelings. Feelings are simply appearing on the face, on the horizon, on the surface of the oceanic freedom of space, of awareness. You are already unaffected, my friends. Already undisturbed, my friends. You are already free, my friend, myself. So practice this two to five seconds, if you wish to, if you can, 500 times each day until you open next lesson and start to enjoy it, start to feel the power of it, the freedom of it, the liberation in it, the relief in it, the ease in it, the deservability of it all. I love you and we're awake, we are aware. Let us rest in that space until we know beyond a shadow of a doubt that we are the unaffected witness of the universe.